Guys, we're here with Brad Underwood, the only men's basketball coach today. Um, first of all, coach, with the Big Ten as tough as it is, what do you take the mentality going into how you guys are come out on top? Well, I think it's pretty simple. I think, you know, we try to be very consistent every day. Um, you know, the one thing that we can't control is is uh, if the ball goes in. Yeah. Uh, and we've tried to do that through uh, being very consistent with our defense. We've been one of the better defensive teams in the league. Uh, we've been one of the top rebounding teams in the country, and that's been, a, to this point, a good formula for us. So how has Iowa been such a crucial part to the team's success this season? Well, he's one of the best players in the league. That helps. You can start with his talent. Uh, now you've got a guy with a lot of experience. Uh, you know, he went through some ups and downs as a freshman, and, and uh, now all that, uh, uh, all those minutes, all those games, all those experiences have turned into a uh, real positive uh, situation for him because he's been able to gain confidence from that. After a tough loss or a tough stretch you guys have had, um, what is the team's focus on as far as being a coach and what is your – as far as accomplishing the ultimate goal, yeah, we nothing, nothing's changed with us. I mean, we, you know, in a league that's this good, you're, you know, you're going to get dinged once or twice or whatever, and you, you move on. So all you try to do is, is uh, uh, stay consistent, keep your guys doing the same things, and uh, uh, you know, we, we tough loss to Michigan State, a game could have gone either way, and game in Iowa that could have gone either way, and and. Uh, uh, you know, you, we, we've won our first year of those, so uh, you know, we'll just keep doing what we do and, and uh, uh, move on to the next game. So what's life like being a coach for the one of basketball? Well, right now it's a grind. <laughs> it's not easy. I mean, it's uh, when you're in the middle of a 20-game conference season, and, uh, you know, great example, last night I was in New York City recruiting. Mm -hmm. Uh, you know, you, you, there's no days off. Uh, there's very little sleep. Uh, you know, I got home at midnight. We practice at 6.30 this morning, so you're up at 5.15. Uh, I'm not a great sleeper anyway. Uh, <laughs> sure not but, getting much at all. But uh, so you, you, uh, you, learn to, uh, you learn to adapt and, and realize that, uh, uh, you know, all these guys need your best mm -hmm. focus and your best energy and, and uh, uh, you know, a lot of scouting reports, a lot of film. And uh, you know, and then it's a lot of uh, you know a lot of attention with our uh -huh. players. So you guys are sixteen and eight and eight and five in conference. So you got a big game at Rutgers on Saturday, and you go to Penn State. What are the keys after going on the road with a big two game stretch like this? Well, we've been you know we've been consistent on the road. You know, yeah. we played well on the road, and in fact, we've probably played better basketball uh, on the road than we have at, um, at the State Farm Center. Mm -hmm. And uh, so we've got to we've got to be able to translate that over and, and continue that mm -hmm. and. Uh, uh, you know, we don't get too far ahead. It's just one game at a time. Rutgers is next, and we'll worry about uh, Penn State on uh, Saturday night after that game. Brad, thank you for thank you for talking. Thank Go you. Line Great, appreciate it. appreciate that. You know, it's one of the better defensive teams in the country. It's a team that uh, uh, extremely active hands. They're physical, and uh, they're a team that uh, rebounds basketball very very well. Uh, they're even in their losses. Uh, they're plus on the. Uh, on, on the rebounding side for the season, so uh, we got to be very good there, um, and, uh, and we've got to execute. Our, our uh, one of our big keys is we can't have live ball turnovers. Uh, they rely on transition a great deal. Jacob Young is one of the uh, elite transition players uh, in the country, to go along with Geo, and uh, uh, you see why they're having having a great year. All right, buddy. So season wise for you, how you feeling? Uh, I feel good. Good. Yeah. So what, what's the keys going to the record here on the 7th floor? Whoa. Hey, Brad. Oh, hey, Jay, got that one. Yeah, yeah there you go. go. Yeah, yeah, you, got, you got to beat that one. <laughs> no, just, uh, just playing with confidence. Uh, mm -hmm. 1 through 16, no matter who it is, uh, and going out there and competing and playing for each other. So you guys had a tough game against Michigan State. Mm -hmm. I'm going down. I know you guys lost that game, but what do you guys take that game into? You guys were down by 20 almost. Oh, you guys to come back and make a comeback. How do you define how the team did that game? Uh, playing together, we didn't do anything we wanted to yeah. uh, accomplish anything. I mean, we proved that we can play with anybody in the country. We just got to uh, have it for the whole thing. I like him better than what it takes. Oh, great. I mean, he's going to get up in you. Uh, yeah. Falls, but he's going to make sure you do what you got to do. And uh, he, he still will love you at the yeah. end of the day. Hey, thank you. I appreciate it. No problem. Good luck. Thank you. you got it. All right, here's Alan Griffin. So, Alan, um, how's practice going for you guys right now? Going good. Going good? good. So, um, as far as the season outlook for you guys, um, 
You guys are 16 and 8. How's the season been progressing all season for you guys? Uh, we've had ups and downs, and, but we're, we're finding that mode where we just stay mm -hmm. even, you know, and never get too high, never get too low. Coming off the game all season out against Michigan State, I mean, as far as you guys came back, talk about the team's perseverance coming back. You guys didn't win the, win the game, but you guys were able to make a comeback. Talk about that a little bit. Uh, we're not some moral victories, but like, you know, we're, we're going to keep fighting uh, mm -hmm. to the game's over. You know, the game's not over to the clock says zero. Yeah. And, uh, that's shown, yeah. even though we didn't come up with the win, but it showed that you got to keep fighting at the game. You don't know what yeah. the game You know how tough it is to win the big stand. Every game is every ball at possession. I mean, what do you got to do to beat, beat Rutgers on Saturday? Uh, execute uh, both ends of the floor. Uh, mm -hmm. Stop their transition points. Yes. Execute. Just execute. Alan, good luck on Saturday. Thank you. Appreciate Thank you, it. You got it. Good luck.